During an internet search to delete images of Bumblebee, Raph uncovered a picture of a Cybertronian escape pod. RC asked if it was Autobot or Decepticon before Ratchet stated the image resolution made it impossible to tell and Optimus claimed that the POD's landing ordered investigation. RC claimed that it could be a trap, reminding Ratchet that the two were down an Autobot and asked if they should try to contact Wheeljack before Ratchet reminded her of Wheeljack's previous revenge stunt. After arriving at the crash site, RC dusted the pod off and discovered the pod was of Decepticon origin before being shot at by a multitude of Insecticons. While exchanging fire, RC questioned if all the Insecticons came out of the escape pod before being explained to by Ratchet that humans referred to the phenomenon as a clown car. After Ratchet is grabbed by an Insecticon, RC attacked it, causing it to lose its grip on him and latch itself onto her. However, RC kicked the Insecticon in the face and was able to get away. Following a new Autobot's arrival on the scene, RC and the others watched him as he took out a multitude of Viacons. After Smokescreen asked if he had made a good plan, RC denied it to be one, citing it as a random shot that nearly got the group killed. After Optimus began to allow Smokescreen into the Autobot base, RC immediately began to question him, asking if all he just heard from Smokescreen was enough before inviting him to the base. After Ratchet revealed interest in discovering how he arrived on Earth, RC continued her suspicion by asking how he did so in a Decepticon escape pod. While Smokescreen viewed the base, she and the others conversed with Bulkhead over the both new and young Autobot, whom he believed to have been taking his place. RC objected to this, stating that Smokescreen was too green. Following Smokescreen's return and eagerness to go with the other Autobots to secure Red Energon, Optimus told him he would need to get a vehicle mode, with RC continuing his statement by telling him that it would be a necessity in order to keep a low profile before insultingly stating if it was possible for him. She went with Optimus and Bumblebee to the Red Energon's location. Upon her arrival, she questioned if Fowler could not simply have the humans lower the crane, of which the Red Energon was on before Starscream arrived and donned the Apex armor. While Optimus fought the Decepticon, RC and Bumblebee tried to secure the Red Energon before Smokescreen arrived to aid them, defeating him by removing him from the armor via the phase shifter. 